concern. I was sitting on an airplane and the nice talkative man in the middle seat, if I think someone is talkative, oh my God, they're so talkative. And he's telling me where he's going and what he's doing and what his business is. And he says, so what do you do, darling? And I said, well, I'm a teacher and now I work with the National Education Association. And he stopped smiling. And he said, I've heard about you people. He said, I hear you need this, and then I hear you need that, and then I hear you need something else. And to tell you the truth, darling, I'm getting tired of hearing it. I'm a businessman. I want you to bottom line it for me. I want you to tell me right now, what is the one single thing that would solve all of our problems in public schools? And I said, that's easy. What we really need are fewer people who think there's one single thing that would solve all of our problems in public schools. And you know, I wish I hadn't been so snotty to that guy, but it was fun. And here's the thing, he's not the enemy. Most people, their kids are grown and gone or they never had kids, they don't walk into a neighborhood public school. I'm an educator. It's up to me to educate the man in the middle seat as much as to educate a politician about what happens in any given typical school on any given typical day. I mean, we serve kids a hot meal. We put Band-Aids on boo-boos. We diversify our curriculum and instruction to meet the personal and individual needs of all of our students, the blind, the hearing impaired, the physically challenged, the gifted and talented, the chronically targeted, and the medically annoying. We make sure that they've had their immunizations, make sure they understand disease control, teach them to resist drugs, alcohol, tobacco. We give career counseling, pregnancy counseling, mental health counseling. We get them on the bus safely. We take them off the bus safely. We provide computer instruction, sex education. We stop bullying, teach them to say, I'm sorry, and mean it. We instill an understanding of civil rights, the political process, challenge racism, foster social tolerance and appreciation for our cultural and religious diversity. We teach the principles of free enterprise, how to be a good sport. We develop personal responsibility, practice bicycle safety, and check for head lice. We provide bilingual education, teach metrics, how to be a wise consumer, exercise weight control, how to drive a car. We teach the impact of wars, develop collaborative skills, how to tune a violin, how to use a reason and evidence to protect the future. We teach them to revere their environment, how to manage their money, how to access information, how to make wise choices, how to balance a checkbook. We teach loyalty to the ideals of a democracy. We build patriotism, good oral hygiene, and respect for the worth and dignity of every individual. We nurture curiosity, encourage a good question, build self-esteem, and then we teach reading, writing, and arithmetic. 